Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team forecast with meteorologist Brian Argenti. You got some high level clouds pushing into the capital now. We're looking live on our Harrisburg sky cam. Still got some blue in the sky there, but it's going to be a nice day today, and but also very dry as we go into the rest of the day, into the afternoon today. 53 degrees now over the capital, 46 degrees for our dew point, so it's uh, it's pretty dry out there. We actually have a fire risk or an elevated fire risk today because of how dry and how breezy it's going to become as we get into this afternoon. Look at these wind values here. Northwest breeze of right around 10 to 15 miles an hour, gusts of up to 30 miles per hour in spots. So I would be aware if you have if you plan on doing any burning today, I would try to refrain from doing so today until we're out of the elevated fire risk. But overall, we're mostly sunny today, 62 to 66 degrees. The breeze diminishes by the time we get into tonight. It'll be mostly clear 36 to 40 degrees for your lows. And as we go into tomorrow afternoon, 54 to 58 degrees cooler. It'll be mostly sunny again, thanks to high pressure that's building in from the west. 48 now in Lancaster, 45 in York, 56 now in Carlisle and again those dew points out there across the Commonwealth we are dry as, as, a, as almost a desert out there and some of these current sustained winds we're starting to see the pickup in, in the breeze here five miles an hour in Lancaster six miles an hour in York now 12 miles an hour in Lewistown so again with the dry conditions as well as the breezy weather I mean we, and we also have low relative humidity this is going to elevate the risk of wildfire spread today so again I, I would refrain from doing any type of burning today. If you're headed out today to the uh, to the Pumpkin Palooza in Hershey Gardens, it'll be today and tomorrow from 9 to 5, 52. We're starting off right around with some sun and clouds right around 9 o'clock. And then we'll have some more sunshine as we go to the 1 o'clock hour this afternoon, 62 degrees. It'll be breezy though as soon as we get to the 5 o'clock hour. We'll top out right around 64 degrees for our highs. Weather and health for the day today, low pollen levels, moderate mold levels, Air quality is good. The UV index is low. We have about a 50 minute burn time. We can see some of these high level clouds on our satellite that I overlaid over our Storm Team Live Radar Network. You can see, again, that's due to a cold front that's going to be, or that has already passed through the area. So we are starting off with some sun and clouds for this morning. As we go through the rest of the day today into this evening, you can see the high pressure, the influence of the high pressure is starting to take over the Susquehanna Valley. And it's going to be promoting these mostly sunny conditions as well as breezy conditions as we go into the rest of the day today. Now tomorrow to start off your Sunday morning, we're still we're still mostly sunny. We're, it's a nice day tomorrow and here comes that high pressure building in from the west. That's going to settle in over the area as we go into the day tomorrow as well as into Monday morning and also into Monday evening. So nice, uh, nice couple of days setting up for us here these next few days. Although for Sunday night and the Monday, I want to make a quick note. We rated it as an impact night from Sunday night and the Monday morning. Now the reason why is because you see this this temperature here, the uh, the lows for Sunday right around 36 degrees. Some areas could go below 36 degrees, so we could see some spots freeze. So we have a, we actually have a freeze watch in effect, and that's why we wanted to rate uh, overnight Sunday as an impact night. But as we go into Monday during the day, we'll we'll rise to the lower 60s and check this out. Tuesday through the rest of the week, 68 Tuesday, then we jump to the 70s this week. Uh, it's Halloween, we could be breaking some records or challenging records in the uh, midweek uh, this upcoming week, but it's going to be very warm, so look forward to it.